Hey y'all, hey, welcome back to my channel. I am Shanice Walker and I thank you, thank you so much for clicking the button and finding some importance in what I have to say. I am your motivational speaker and your life coach. So look y'all, God had gave me this word. Um, I believe it was the beginning of the week y'all and it ties in, my life actually ties in to what God had spoke. Uh, he dropped it in my spirit, y'all, and I've been trying to get up here with y'all, but I had turned the page, baby. I turned the page, and my life has been uh, somewhat kind of busy, so um, happy Friday to everybody. Here I am. Um, like I said, I hope everybody's doing good today. Um, I hope you all have a great weekend, uh, so let's just get right into the message. Look, God wants you to know on today, turn the page. Baby, turn the page, turn the page on that old thing that you got going on that you know is no longer serving you. Whatever it is that you know that God's presence has left that situation. You know that God's grace has left that situation. One thing that I understand now after um, communing with God and just spending time with God and just allowing him to, to be the instructor of my life. I understand now that, and y'all have to excuse me, I'm outside. So I got a lot of distractions going on around me. So if you see me looking away, I'm looking at a bird, a car, uh, uh, something. But um, after allowing God to do so much in my life, I understand that there becomes a season where you you know when God has left a situation. You will know you will you will no longer feel um um his presence there. You will no longer feel his grace there. You there will be uh chaotic things going on. There will be all kinds of things going on um around you and 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 in that situation y'all uh I'm going to be a little bit transparent on today. Um like I said, I had been uh, fairly busy for like a week because like I said, I turned the page. I turned the page in my life because I knew that where I was, it was no longer serving me. I, I left a uh, job that I had been at for a while and God said, you know what? He had been told me that it was time to go. Um, this situation may not be your situation. Your situation might be a relationship. Your situation might be uh, some, whatever your situation is. God wants you to know on today, turn the page. It is time for you to go. It is time for you to move forward. God said where he has prepared for you, you're going to know that this place is for me. This is what God has for me. Look, let me tell you something. Let's go back to what I was telling you about the job, the job situation. I had been on that job for a minute and God has been um, prompting me to, to, to turn the page. God has been prompting me to turn the page for at least about two months. And I still continue to stay. I still continue to, um, do whatever I wanted to do in the situation. I still continue to linger around and God is like, okay, beloved, you, you still want to stay there. You see that this is not working for you. You see that things are not going the way that you planned them to go. You see that uh, there has been struggle in your life. You see that these things are happening and you're still continuing to stay in a place where I have lifted my hand, where I have, um, giving you clearance. I have told you that your time is up here. Your season is up. It is time for you to go. So for you on today, God wants you to know your clearance is up. He has given you your clearance. He is, he is giving you the okay to leave. He is telling you it is time to go. God said the place that he has prepared for you, you can no, no man no man can fathom. God said he has laid everything out for you. He said, yeah, I know. I know that you may be a little fear fearful. I know that you may be a little confused. God said, but that is the work of the enemy. God is not the author of confusion. I'm going to say that again, baby. That is the work of the enemy. God is not the author of confusion. Baby, it is time for you to turn the page. And let me tell you something. Once I turned the page, 
once I turned the page and done exactly what God has been instructing me to do for the last past two months, baby, the when I tell you the windows of heaven opened up and everything just fell into place, that's how you are gonna know. You gonna know when God is in the midst of a thing. There won't be a struggle. There won't be any confusion. There won't be any fear. And whenever you get there, everything just happens for you in order. Everything just falls into place. Baby, turn the page. Turn, turn the page. I was so glad that I had turned the page and I sat and I thought about it. Oh, excuse me, y'all. I sat and I thought about it and I thought, Shanice, you was really just whooping your own tail. You was whooping your own tail, being hard-headed, trying to stay in your comfort zone, doing whatever was comfortable for you. Because a lot of times we fall into those, those, those uh, patterns of, of being comfortable. Let me tell you something. I can't remember who it was. I want to say it was um, E.T. that said, your comfort zone is your your uh resting place your comfort zone is like a funeral of a a, a a graveyard excuse me a graveyard he said once you have sat in your comfort zone for so long he said you might as well that's your graveyard pick a plot and start digging and this season god needs for you to get as uncomfortable as possible stay uncomfortable it don't feel good, that's the place that you need to be in. It don't look good, go to God. Talk to God, because I'm telling you now, a lot, and that was a lot of things for me too, y'all. God is so simple. God is not hard. He is not hard. He, he lives on the inside of you. You ask for it. You ask for what you need. The answer will be provided ask for what you need and the answer will be provided that was for somebody baby grab a hold to that turn the page turn the page because god got something bigger he got something better he got something greater even though you don't understand you you can't see the other side all you know is this is what you used to doing this worked for you in your last season and oh baby you you want it so badly to work for you in this new season and god is saying look i got something better he needs for you to 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 roll right with him roll with him god is not gonna stay in the same place all the time god is not gonna stay in the same place and as a chosen vessel you have to learn